In this elementary tutorial video, I will show how to add a Google review slider or carousel in an elementary page in WordPress. So over here, you can see this is a Google reviews showing up and it is pulling the Google reviews from this Google business over here, uh, which is uh, which I pulled up from Google Maps over here and it is showing the reviews over here and it automatically updates when someone submits a new review over here. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to uh, add this Google review slider to this place over here on this website over here, uh, just to show you as an example. Over here, as you can see, there is a static uh, review, which, which doesn't auto update and it is not uh, genuine from Google, pulled from directly from Google. So I'm going to add this kind of slider over here. So what I'm going to do firstly, I'm going to go to the back end of the website, go to the dashboard. Okay, so I'm going to the back end of the website. Great. Now I'm going to do, I'm going to go to plugins and I'm going to add plugin. Now I'm going to search for Google reviews. Okay. Google reviews. And uh, I'm going to install this plugin. Uh, it is all five star reviews and over 600,000 plus active installations. So I'll install this one over here. Okay, it's installing. And I'm also going to activate this one. Great, it's installed and activated. And then what I'm going to do, I'm going to go over here, trustindex.io. So this is the name of that plugin. So I'll click over here. Okay, great. So it shows me some steps over here. So first thing, I need to connect this to this Google business to uh, this plugin over here. So I'll simply cl click on connect. Okay, so it's opening up a pop-up over here. So it's loading. Okay, great. So Google business profile name or location. Okay. Um, instead, we can do is uh, we can go to this. This is the Google map URL. Okay, of this business. So what I can do, I can simply copy this entire thing over here. I will simply control A to select everything and copy and paste it not over here uh, there's a pop-up over here you see that this is the pop-up okay let me just so i'll just place this uh, paste this in the pop-up which popped up great i'll just simply so you see the name of the business pops up over here and i'll simply click on connect great it's connected over here and as you see it's connecting and now it's you see that it's connected okay uh, so i'm going to see uh, which layout i'm going to choose so what i'm going to do i like this one slider this one slider over here i like this one and you see there are op other option as well uh, google over here good review there's the one here this kind of over here slider, different designs, okay? You see there are different designs over here and uh, a testimonial like this over here or like a layout list, list like this, great, with photos. You can choose different kind of things, but uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to choose uh, this one over here, slider, I'll click on select. Okay, I've selected this, uh, then select style. You see, you will find different style, light background, uh, light border, uh, drop shadow, minimal, soft, and light contrast, and also dark background, okay? So if a dark website, dark uh, design, you can use this one over here. So, but I'm going to use uh, this one over here. I like this one, select.
Great. Uh, so this is the preview of the widget over here. And show all your ratings. You see, uh, you can choose how many ratings you want, you want to show. Uh, maybe you can only show high ratings. Okay, only five star, only only four to uh, four to five stars. So over here you see one star review. You can hide this using this one. You can hide this so that you can only show four to five star. Okay, over here uh, language should be English, and you can choose other language to show your reviews in. And date format, name of format. Okay, align left, not text are align left, and read text read more okay uh, read more you can uh, expand the reviews over here okay so that they are not uh, not large or small okay and these are some things uh, which you can go over so i am ready uh, to publish this so i'm going to uh, click on this save and get code okay now over here you get the short code to embed this uh, testimonial carousel google testimonial carousel so what i'm going to do i'm going to uh, come over here open this page up in elementor okay uh, firstly let's open this page up in elementor So then I'm, I can, what I can do, I can just uh, copy this short code, copy to clipboard, it is copied, and this page is opened up in Elementor. I will scroll down to over here, testimonial part, and I can type in short code. You see, this short code element uh, comes over here. I can paste it over here, drag and drop it over here. Then I can paste the short code over here. You see it immediately appears and then I can click on apply. See it if I click on apply. You see it appears uh, this part of appears over here reviews appears over here in a click. And it works perfectly. I can remove this. Remove this and update this. Okay. So it is updated. I can refresh this page and see how it looks. Okay. If I scroll down and you see this Google reviews immediately appears. And this is how it looks. Great. And for bigger reviews, you can click on read more. This will show more reviews. Okay, great. So this is how you add Google reviews in Elementor and WordPress. Uh, this how can how easily you can add it. Uh, simply follow this process in the video I have shown. So I hope this video helped you out. And if it did, then please make sure to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you.